So I'm in Hoi An, and uh, it's a nice day. It's, it's about 8 o'clock in the morning. We've got a light, light rain falling. And this is actually the Japanese bridge. Very famous old, old bridge. Hoi An's a pretty cool place. It's all historic. Well, not all of it, the, the ancient town. It's a very historic place. And it's just really quaint, beautiful buildings. It was once a major import-export port city. It's all been kept in pretty good condition. They've, they've um, made laws so you can't change much of the buildings. Uh, so it's not exactly my favorite place in Vietnam because it doesn't quite feel like Vietnam. It's just a lot more touristy than I like. But it's beautiful here. And it's, it's all a matter of finding the right time of day to wander around, you know, when it's quiet and and there's not too many tourists around. A lot of shopping here, which isn't really my thing, but I'm actually traveling with my mother today. And she is over here. And of course, she loves to shop. So it's good mom town. So it's about 8.30 now. It's actually 25 after. And um, you see the motorbikes riding around down here. But at 8.30 exactly, the motorbikes are no longer allowed to ride in this area. It's only bicycles and pedestrians. There's lots of delicious dishes in Poyan, but I've been a victim of the hotel breakfast. I have to admit, I ate way too much. No, thank you. They had pumpernickel bread, and I haven't had that in a long time, so I went a little nuts. Um, it's a big mistake. It's nice to see a lot of locals still buying stuff here. I was worried the market would be all just tourist stuff, but obviously the locals are still using this. Ah, yes. Chom chom. Chom chom. How much is it? Oh, it's like nothing. 5,000. 5,000? Okay. Thank you. Or in Vietnamese, chom chom. Which kind of roughly translates out to uh, messy hair. Maybe they say chom chom to people who have messy hair. I don't know, I know there's some correlation there, but they're pretty delicious. Beautiful. There's a seed in it, you gotta watch out for. But, really juicy and sweet around the seed. The seed's kind of big all the time though. Ladies, it's fishing stuff from the well. That's old school. Okay, so mom's off shopping, and I am going to go get what apparently is the best banh mi in all of Vietnam, according to Anthony Bourdain and people on TripAdvisor. On the phone. Oh. Yeah, there it is. Best, this is the best, apparently. Hey, Wow, Hey, Hey, Might just be the best. I have something there for sure. The bread here is a little bit different than the rest of the bread I've had in Bon Me. Really crunchy on the outside. And uh, toppings, a little bit more generous. They must marinate that, that chicken. Instead of just normal chilies, they had like a chili paste they put on it. 
pate was like really crumbly and, and oily, which of course, of course, oil is delicious, despite what anybody tells you. So I found my mother. She's all shopped out for now. And we're gonna get some lunch at New Eatery. So this seems to be their version of Cao Lao. It's good. Ma got sesame chicken. And she raves about it. Not a bad day in Hoi An. I say we get some dinner and you probably want to do more shopping. No shopping. No? Mm, we'll see. No. How pretty it is. Look how much back sweat that guy has. Mm, it's a shame.